And in news from Sri Lanka, Sri Lanka pledged to boost tax revenues and reduce the budget deficit on Monday as President Ranil Vikramasinghe presented the annual budget in the parliament aimed at winning the bailout funds from the International Monetary Fund. Vikramasinghe said the crisis at Sri Lankan economy can turn around by end of 2023 if the new policies are followed. Sri Lanka's President Ranil Vikramasinghe on Monday pledged to boost tax revenues and reduce the budget deficit as he announced the annual budget aiming to wean the economy away from populist policies to win bailout funds from the International Monetary Fund. The crisis hit Sri Lankan economy can turn around by end of 2023 if the budget policies are followed, Vikramasinghe said. IMF recommendations have only been looked at to stabilize the economy, he told the parliament. Vikramasinghe said the government plans to reduce debt to less than 100% of GDP over the medium term and achieving economic growth of 7%. Public revenue is expected to rise to 15% of GDP by 2025 from 8% currently. The government targets revenue of 9.27 billion US dollars in 2023, up 63% from the current year, while limiting the increase in spending to 31% year on year. The $2.9 billion IMF bailout package agreed earlier this year is key to pulling the nation out of its worst economic crisis in decades. It would also help Colombo secure other lines of funding as it nearly ran out of foreign exchange reserves this year, resulting in a sovereign debt default. Sri Lanka currently experiencing consumer price growth of 66% will aim for mid-single-digit inflation in the medium term, Vikramasinghe said.